un-American. That's what controversial Councilman Ben Colasho in El Cajon is calling the person who vandalized his political signs. 10 News reporter Lauren Davis is live in El Cajon at Weld Boulevard in Cuyamaca Street. And Lauren, 53 signs were spray painted. That is right. Here is one of the signs that he's had to replace. And as you can see, someone's come by and torn it down a little bit. But over there on the ground, three more signs that vandals have spray painted. Now someone vandalized them with a round red circle with a slash through it and spray painted his eyes on some. Colasho has gone back and put another sign above them, blaming the vandalism on his opponent who denies having anything to do with it. Colasho is a controversial council member faced with lawsuits for fraud, sexual harassment, and most recently failing to properly record his real estate loans. Colasho filed a police report over these defaced signs and says he's going to prosecute whoever did this. I mean, it goes against everything that uh, democracy stands for because the good old days were if you didn't like a candidate, you just simply place your sign next to theirs. Now the, the atmosphere is so volatile that people go the, that extra step and, and deface the sign. Now he says the signs cost him $5,000 and he posted those signs above them. That was $700. Now coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, we're going to hear from Colosho's opponent, Gary Kendrick. We're going to have that for you coming up tonight at 6 o'clock. Live in El Cajon, Lauren Davis, 10 News.